Altair, welcome, welcome. I've done what you asked. Now give me the marker. First things first. Tell me what you know. Tamir rules over the Souk El Salah. He makes his fortune selling arms and armor and is supported by many in this endeavor. Blacksmiths, traders, financiers. He's the largest death dealer in the land. And have you devised a way to rid us of this blight? A meeting is being arranged at Souk El Salah to discuss an important sale. They say it's the largest deal Tamir has ever made. He'll be distracted with his work. That's when I'll strike. Your plan seems solid enough. I give you leave to go. Let Al Mualim's will be done. You may rest here until you are ready. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. Altair, my friend! Is something wrong? Has Tamir been delayed? Has he left the city? Everything is fine, Rafiq. Ah, I see. Then why return so soon? Wait, do not answer. It is not for me to question your ways. I am certain no matter how strange your approach to this task, you will succeed. Another minute and they would have made off with me. I owe you my freedom, sir. Horrible. There! Paper! Oh, you won't get away from me! Please, 
Can't you smell something? I'm poor and sick and hungry. No, please don't leave. Just a few coins, please. If you just have a look. I have no interest in your calculations. The numbers change nothing. Your men have failed to fill the order, which means I have failed my client. We need more time. This is the excuse of a lazy or incompetent man. Which are you? Neither. What I see says otherwise. Now, tell me, what do you intend to do to solve this problem of ours? These weapons are needed now. I see no solution. The men work day and night, but your client requires so much, and the destination, it is a difficult route. Would that you could produce weapons with the same skill as you produce excuses. I have done all I can. It is not enough. Then perhaps you ask too much. Too much? I gave you everything. Without me, you would still be charming serpents for coin. All I ask in return was you fill the orders I bring you, and you say I ask too much? <laughs> you dare disrespect me? Peace, Tamir. I meant no insult. Then you should have kept your mouth shut! No! Stop! Stop? <laughs> I'm just getting started. No! Stop! You came into my souk, stood before my men, and dared to insult me! You must learn your place! No. Leave the body. Let this be a lesson to the rest of you. Think twice before you tell me something cannot be done. Now get back to work. Seems you're the one pays now, my friend. You'll not profit from suffering any longer. You think me some petty death dealer, suckling at the breast of war? A strange target, don't you think? Why me, when so many others do the same? You believe yourself different, then? Oh, but I am. For I serve a far nobler cause than mere profit. Just like my brothers. Brothers? Ah. But he thinks I act alone. I am but a piece. A man with a part to play. You'll come to know the others soon enough. They won't take kindly to what you've done. Good. I look forward to ending their lives as well. Such pride. It will destroy you, child.
word has reached me of your victory, Altair. You have my gratitude and my respect. Thank you. It is a shame that the other assassins continue to hold you in such poor regard. Rafiq, I do not care what the others think of me. As you wish, Altair. You should bring news of your victory to Al Malim. I'm certain he has more work for you to do. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. Out of the machine, Mr. Miles. What's the matter, Doc? Miss Stillman is once again insisting I let you rest. So, feel like telling me who put the stick up his ass? We have a deadline. One week. Well, six days now. Deadline? I can't talk about it. Man, put yourself in my shoes. I'm being held hostage by a group of scientists, at least I think you're scientists, and forced to spend all day in some crazy-ass machine. You won't tell me what you're looking for or why you want it, but I'm supposed to be thanking you for keeping me alive. This is so fucked. Sorry, but it is. What do you want me to do? Hmm, let's see. I don't know. Maybe give me some answers? I can't. And it's better this way. Safer. Safer for who? Both of us. Let's go, Mr. Miles. Time's wasting. Where's Lucy? Oh, don't worry. She'll be with us soon enough. So why are you doing all this, Doc? What are you hoping to accomplish? You turn the television on lately? Read the newspaper? Never cared much for that stuff. Then, let me sum it up for you. The world's a mess. It's pathetic, really. You've seen it firsthand yourself. A thousand years between you and your ancestor, and society remains just as barbaric. Just as stupid. And your point is... Order, Mr. Miles. The world needs order. That is what we're working towards, and that is what you're helping us to achieve. <laughs> you expect me to believe you're building a better tomorrow? That's exactly what we're doing. The human race calls out for direction. They want to know why they're here, what they're meant to do. Well, we're going to tell them. And once they understand how to live their lives, everything will be better. Better how? An end to all conflicts. Large and small. Isn't that what you assassins strive for? Peace in all things? I told you, I'm not an assassin. Right, right. I still don't see where I fit into things. In time, Mr. Miles. In time, you'll understand. Or you won't. I don't care either way, as long as you show us where it is. Where what is? Sorry I'm late. Yes, we are.
Remember to reach out for ledges should you fall while climbing. You've done well, Altair. And I'm confident that this is but the first of many successes. Tamir spoke as if he knew you well. He implied my work had a larger meaning. Significance comes not from a single act, but the context within which it is performed. The consequences born of it. Then is there more I need to know? Altair, your greatest failure was born of knowing too much. If I choose to withhold information, it is only to ensure you do not make the same mistake a second time. I see. No, you don't. And it will remain this way until you've learned your lesson. Still, you have performed competently. And as such, I restore a rank and will return a piece of your equipment. Go now, either to Akka or Jerusalem. There are men in both cities who require your attention. The Bureau leaders can tell you more about what needs to be done. Altair, it seems my students do not fully understand what it is to wield a blade. Perhaps you could show them what you know. How we all should fight. You must be busy. I understand. Ah! <sighs> 
I'll have your head! Use the action view to gather information about your surroundings.
Kill him! Stop him! Right, it's for them! When the Animus shows you are being watched by an informed guard, you should blend immediately. Even the slightest disturbance will attract his attention. Was that absolutely quite the fright?
Your presence annoys me. Move. Uh. Hey, you look familiar. Troubled times in which we live. Food is scarce, money tight, but it need not be this way. There are opportunities for those with the courage to seize them. You need no longer go without. Any man willing to work can have his due. Come, speak with me. Let me tell you what Talal can offer. The comforts of a fine life can be yours. Talal understands your pain. What you lack, he will provide. All that is asked is an honest day's work. A small sacrifice for great rewards. Who knows what the future holds? What tragedies tomorrow may bring? Defend against an uncertain future. Protect the ones you love. Work hard and you will be rewarded. The Lao provides. You need no longer go with us. Any man willing to work can have his due. Come, speak with me. Let me tell you what Talal can offer. The comforts of a fine life can be yours. These no, you don't understand. I have nothing. Live. Food is scarce, money tight, but no, it need please, not be this way. Just there a few coins, please. The courage to seize them. Want the bargain? I'm your man. Come, come. Any man willing to work? They go against the will of God and must be made to pay. Everywhere they ride, they leave only suffering in their wake. They say it is a crusade. A crusade for what? Ignorance? Safety and peace, Malik. Your presence here deprives me of both. What do you want? Al Muallam has asked. Asked that you perform some menial task in an effort to redeem yourself. So be out with it. Tell me what you can about the one they call Talal. It is your duty to locate and assassinate the man, Altair, not mine. You'd do well to assist me. His death benefits the entire land. Do you deny his death benefits you as well? Such things do not concern you. Your actions very much concern me. Then don't help me. I'll find him myself. <sighs> wait, wait. It won't do having you stumble about the city like a blind man. Better you know where to begin your search. I'm listening. I can think of three places. South of here in the markets that line the border between the Muslim and Jewish districts. To the north near the mosque of this district, and east in front of St. Anne's Church, close to the Babariha Gate. Is that everything? It's enough to get you started, and more than you deserve. Die, Steve! 
You want some? Go to jail. Have your head. Long when you did. Another minute and they would have made off with me. This is an ill omen. What happened to this poor soul? Horrible. Now, me, please, you follow a false god. <laughs> help! I need help! Please, anyone! You follow a false god. Your presence is always. Please, you're hurting me. I'll see to it that we hear this tale and know what it is to be a true hero. Please, sir, have any money? 
saw what happened here. Holds. What tragedies tomorrow may bring. Defend against an uncertain future. Protect the ones you love. Work hard and you will be rewarded. Talal provides. These are troubled times in which we live. Food is scarce, money tight, but it need not be this way. There are opportunities for those with the courage to seize them. Who knows what the future holds? What tragedies tomorrow may bring. Defend against an uncertain future. Protect the ones you love. Work hard and you will be rewarded. Talal provides. You have something to say? to say to you speak to me or speak to God it's your choice you won't stop the work he does cannot stop it stop what what work he prepares them for the journey journey where they are held in his warehouse and when the time comes they are sent to Akka where is this warehouse and why Akka Talal tells me what I need to know nothing more it is safer that way for him, perhaps. Though not, I fear, for you.
It's forbidden for you to be here. If the guard won't take action, it falls to us to do something. What you propose is madness. But necessary. How many more will we allow to go missing before the people take a stand? It does not affect us. Not yet. But if we continue to do nothing, it will. And what do you propose? I've watched the man. Learn everything there is to know about his operation. It's all here on a map I've made. He inspects his stock every day at the same time. This is when I'll strike. 
So you have a piece of paper. It won't save you when you're discovered. Won't shield you from their swords and arrows. If all goes well, it won't come to that. Anyway, it's a risk I'll have to take. Wish me luck, my friend. Indeed. You'll need it.